Hello everyone, and welcome to my Emmerdale News YouTube channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribers button and give this video a thumbs up. Tom King is determined to exact revenge on Belle Dingle for defying him, so he will keep stalking Emmerdale like a harbinger of doom. When Amelia Spencer met Kane behind closed doors, she discovered that Tom had vanished from the village and was hiding in the woods, having learned the truth about his mistreatment of his wife. Amelia believes that terrible Tom is innocent, even though others who are close to her understandably concerned for her safety. They run the danger of driving her away as they attempt to tell her the truth. However, Chaz is taken aback to learn that Amelia is having a meeting with Tom, Natalie, and Jameson's character Amy Wyatt and her mother Carrie also enter the fray, albeit in very different ways. What then is scheduled for next week? Amelia is interrupted by Chaz as she smuggles food into her suitcase. Following a contentious discussion on Tom's innocence, Amelia's steadfast defense of him astounds Chaz. Later, Amy tries to persuade Carrie to be diplomatic with Amelia by bringing up their concerns about her falling for Tom's falsehoods with Chaz, Amy, and Carrie. But when Amelia shows there, the topic swiftly shifts to disagreements about Tom. Carrie is advised by Amy not to push Amelia too hard since she would block them out. As Amelia becomes irate and storms out, Amy becomes worried the following day when she hears Amelia telling Vanessa that Tom's surgical suspension is unjust. Amelia seems uneasy when Amy brings up Tom with her again later. When Amy kindly points out that Tom might be lying to her, she becomes confused. Is she able to connect with her? It appears that things will worsen before they get better because of Tom's skillful manipulation and the weight of his gaslighting on her. Following Tuesday's dramatic episode, fans of Emmerdale are certain they have finally figured out who Ruby and Caleb Milligan's secret daughter is. Ruby's mother Helen, Sharon Mon, received a scary visit from Caleb at the hospital, and it was far from friendly. He intimidated Helen and even used extortion to get her to give up money so she could see her daughter before she died. Caleb was not amused when Ruby's estranged mother made a remark about their daughter during their heated confrontation. It is known to viewers that Nikki Milligan, Caleb and Ruby's son, left the community with his lover. However, given the recent allusions to Nikki and Stephanie, is a stunning comeback imminent? Helen said, I am sure it is of little consequence to you to know I am dying, as she lay in her hospital bed. Yeah, you mentioned over the phone, Caleb remarked icily. I doubt you'd dare get in touch otherwise, you knew the reception you'd get, according to Leeds Liv. Let me tell you, nothing changes since I still won't tell Ruby because I love her too much. She's merely a cheap shot at making up for the fact that you rejected her before you ran off. Helen begged, my daughter has a right to know that I am dying. There are things that need to be said. With an outburst that betrayed his underlying resentment, Caleb said, I know you paid me to ditch her and I know when she got pregnant, you tried to force her to abort our child and I know you turfed her out with nothing and she wouldn't. Ruby's mother said, I have had to live with that my entire life, to which Caleb shot out, and now you'll have to die with it. Tell me, have you seen anything of Stephanie? Caleb's enraged response to her question was, don't you dare even say my kids' names, do you hear me? When Caleb stormed out of the hospital at the end of the episode, saying, when the money lands in my account, I will speak to Ruby, and demanding a big payment from Helen if she ever wanted to see Ruby again, the dramatization reached a new level. Following the show, viewers took to social media to speculate that Caleb and Ruby's daughter might be a Tate, connecting her to Jamie Tate and Kim, Claire King. On X, a spectator conjectured, kids? Multiple. Steph. Who is she? Translates as more Tates in technical terms. One more fan postulated, where is Steph, then? I have a theory, since she is now traveling overseas, she has met Joe Tate or Jamie, therefore making her a member of the family already. Another person offered another perspective, saying, well, I wonder if Caleb got Ruby's mother pregnant and the child was his? Hashtag Emmerdale. It seems like Ruby and Rose could be related, hashtag Emmerdale, wondered yet another enthusiast. 
Has Caleb and Ruby more kids than Nikki? Did anyone else notice Caleb saying, don't you dare mention my kids' names, there's more than Nikki, or did we already know this, said another, echoing the previous one. Someone? In the meantime, Amy Wyatt, Natalie Jameson, tried to talk to Amelia Spencer, Daisy Campbell, head-to-head -head regarding Tom King, James Chase. After Belle Dingle accused her lover of assault, Amelia is working to clear his name. Like he did with Belle, it seems Tom has tricked Amelia, but how far will he go to exact revenge on his wife? Even though nobody seemed to be aware that Amelia and Tom are still in contact, Jimmy King might have learned the truth following their chat. Amelia told Jimmy, he's going crazy for not doing anything, when she was trying to get his job back at the operation. Too much time to think about stuff. You have spoken to him then? Amelia retracted, and Jimmy questioned her, adding, I am just saying, it must be hard for him I imagine. Emmerdale viewers were incensed at Amelia Spencer for siding with aggressive Tom King over Belle Dingle, and it seemed as though she would be in danger. It is revealed to viewers that Tom forcefully ruled Belle for several months before to acting violently in a horrible narrative of domestic violence. Belle had the guts to break up with Tom a few weeks ago, and the previous week she told her loved ones about the abuse she had been subjected to. After Tom created the impression that Belle was mentally ill, a few residents began to trust him instead of Belle. Attempting to shift the blame for his actions onto Belle, he suggested that she was fabricating stories and acting suspiciously. After his real behavior was discovered by the locals and Belle became convinced, Tom fled into hiding. As of right now, only Amelia is aware of Tom's location, and she is eager to prove his innocence by assisting him. Similar to how he tricked Belle, Tom has tricked Amelia into believing he is not guilty and Belle is lying. After they started dating, he gave Amelia the impression that he loved her and wanted to spend his life with her. Amelia has been criticizing Belle a lot since she won't believe that Belle warned her that he was only using her. On Monday, in disgusting scenes, she again supported Tom while demeaning Belle and making fun of her struggles with mental illness. The teenager, who hasn't admitted that she's seen Tom since he disappeared, is unreachable. Tom wants Amelia to be his eyes and ears in the hamlet, watching out for Belle, so he's urged her to keep their meetings private. Carrie and Amy Wyatt faced her once again today, and she growled, what happened to innocent until proven guilty? She didn't think Tom was the abuser Belle had made him out to be, so she ran into them as well as Chaz Dingle. Just a few weeks after they began seeing each other, viewers were incensed at the character for having faith in Tom and for treating Belle so poorly. Amy saw how serious the issue was and told Carrie that if they pushed her, they might lose her. But just a few weeks prior, Belle had the ability to see three possible futures based on her actions. Maybe one of these future scenarios is what we are witnessing right now, when Amelia chooses to go with Tom despite the warnings, Belle had left Tom in this hypothetical scenario, but she hadn't revealed him. Despite this, she continues to worry that he won't face consequences because she hasn't reported him to the authorities. Could Amelia wind up going through something like Belle did if she keeps on supporting Tom? Could Belle's tragically pictured future with Amelia come to pass? James Chase, who is playing Tom in the program, is currently filming his farewell sequences.